Hi Scorpio, welcome to this Twin Flame Tower Love Reading. My name's Sophia, welcome back. Welcome if you're new. <coughs> Let's do this, I've got to do some readings. See what's happening with your person. <laughs> Because your person puts you in a positive, so let's get some positives. Okay, so the overall seven of wands, defensive. So there's a bit of defensive behavior going on at the moment. Let's see if it's between both of you. Um, okay, let me see. So wanting a new start, understanding... Want in a new emotional start with your person. And it looks like there's a change that it might be happening because the hanged man is the first card. So there is a transformation happening. And this is the path, uh, the masculine here. And this is 12. One and two is loving um, oneself. Because two, one is singular, two is two of cups to me. So it's loving oneself, two of cups, which repre which um, this is the suggestion or what is happening. So you're loving yourself, working on yourself, which is transforming onto your person to have a new start, to victoriously starting to invest. Because the judgment call is here. This is like waking his ass up to, to do a new start. The main one is about being in your truth. So this is about 100% working on you. Being in your truth. The Ace of Swords is cutting out all illusions. And hence what's going on in the world. It's cutting out all stagnation. Third dimension of um, people. You know, there's worry about, you know, jobs and stuff like that. Pentacles. If you're all within and understanding how this planet works, there's no issue. It's only those at third dimensional that worry with what's going on. Five of fire is um, what's going on there. This is other people's interference. Generally, when the five of wands comes up, um, it's like you both have um, interference. So your person didn't emotionally invest in in the situation in you because there was some kind of interference from other people now this could be no they're correcting me this is definitely other people into because i was going to say third parties such as kids but they corrected me this is some kind of gossip interference something here that is actually is more of a they're trying to control. Oh, okay. So what I'm getting is with your person, you may not know this. And there's like, if you're new, there's no point going to tell your person anything that I state. All it does is delay it. But there's some kind of like, there's uh, we're all consciousness, but there's different vibrational conscious levels. Your person is rising in conscious levels because so are you, because you're going in within working on yourself. Or like I said, my readings are the suggestions of what to do to bring your person closer. So you're actually going within or suggestion to do that, which is bringing your person on a higher energetic frequency. And as we are all consciousness, it does have an effect on other people. Now, it is their choice to change that but most don't like change hence what's going on now this is the planet systems that are happening and aligning there's lots of big boy planets like capricorn and mars which are uh, um, planets on um, to make changes and is the, the new aquarius age which is about you know doing things differently 
as what's going on at the moment so all those changes are happening so um people don't like the change so your person is vibrate, uh, vibrating differently because you are and they're seeing that and it's causing conflict around the environment that your person's at uh five of airs there's five of air is you both wearing a mask um yeah there was this is all the hidden working on the hidden working on the inside working on the other thing that this shift that's going on on the third dimension i'm i'm focusing on my inner inner world not the outer world right but on the outer world let's say is to do with um going within the last card here is the moon but i'm going to clarify let's see some what else is going on here let's get a bit deeper so let me clarify here the the hanged man <laughs> okay the hanged man okay so it's reflection to the last this is about the hanged man in traditional decks the the head is illuminated so this is about thinking differently and to me you see he's kind of this is your masculine the wings twin flame right and he's connected it looks like the sun the, it's the planet right what right, the sun the, the sun is twin flames because of it's connected to um it's the most positive and we are here to raise the vibration and the sun without the sun there's no planet earth that's why i'm trying to you know tell you lot to raise the vibration as well so this is changing him this is healing him which is creating a new star with the um the full this is the full card here from his control he tried to control this situation by not emotionally investing which created arguments back and forth this is what this is stating here um yeah that control is blowing up that's what's happened um because uh plenty of the readings most people the feminines have walked away because they're tired of the control so let me clarify uh let me clarify the five of uh, five of wands. <laughs> I just said about people walking away, and yes, it's just confirmed it. Other people's interference. Now, this could be you. I said as well. This could be people saying to you, "Get rid of him," blah blah blah. But generally, I'm feeling it's more on their side. They have people interfering with them because. The masculines are not very, the old way of doing things was the twin flames getting their masculines to talk about their person, that matter, I'll just say their person, to talk about the spiritual way, twin flame, 5D, blah, blah, blah. The new wave of doing it is you let your person be who they are. The, the, the feminines, let's say, who finds the connection is their role to be the spiritual person. The masculines, whatever, male, female, over there, the next person, right, it is about um, third dimension because you live on this planet Earth, but you have all the other alchemical elements, which is our jobs. The old way was taking them out of living on planet Earth by making them just live on 5D. There needs to be an equal balance between both. So this is about um, your person... Uh, over there with other people interference and they can't really explain this twin flame connection neither can you right but neither can they because they're on the third dimension there's something like that so this felt this twin flame he was working 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 on it seven of pentacles and it fell see the feathers this is actually called failure so this is like you walking away there was no like um completion like i said there is third party as well now, I like to state when it comes to third party, particularly with Twin Flames, because we're heightened <laughs> with our emotions, um, that could be um, because the Emperor come out here. He's trying to control his work, the kids, please babies, mum, uh, you know, the family, the friends. That's the third party in this situation here. And um, this is about you changing that 
because these are pomegranates, which is the tree of life and understanding, like I said, about your universe within. What's within happens without. It doesn't matter what's going on on the outside. I promise you that. So that's about that, because this is three of um, cups. Um, and this card is called abundance. So you focus on this time on your abundance. No matter what you're seeing, your perception is with this situation with your person. I'm going to clarify a couple here. What's with the five of... Oh, I know what the nine of air is for. This is the five of air. Oh, okay. Okay. So, so the deception... Um, because five of air is kind of like the seven of swords to me. Five of swords, seven of swords... Uh, is um because of look this is the feminine here i'm just going to say it how i see it she's dancing around fluffing around right but she was wearing a mask that's you right okay so it's like which created a nightmare and this is two feminines because the mask the underlying basis is you was wearing a mask of being your true self, the center focus, the ace of swords, which created a nightmare. You had to go within. And this is shadow work. The moon card to me is, uh, well, in this reading, is shadow work. The clarification here is that uh, um, you didn't follow your intuition with the antennas here of this flame. You didn't follow your uh, uh, intuition. Like I said, this is a suggestion, right? So you follow your intuition on the twin flame journey. This is your person that comes behind you. You see? But I want to show you this card. So you connect it. Here. Regardless, look, you have the wand. You manifest this to move forward. The feminines are generally the, the leaders, right? And um, they hold, they follow the wish come true, the stars, the planets, all that, what's going on at the moment, actually. So this is about you changing that nightmare scenario by hiding a mask, by being in your truth and working on your shadow. That balances out your emotions. And that is the overall, which the clarify, this will move it forward. Because this is about being stubborn and stuff like that. With the clarifications. Let me just get one for the um, the overall. <laughs> ah. so okay the overall of, of this reading is the seven of fire which is seven of wands which is defensive behavior so you was defensive because you were presuming that your person was just being silly um you was working on yourself trying to grow this but the deception here with seven of wands why it was defensive behavior back and forth is because you was trying to control it. You was trying to control it on the third dimension way of doing it, which is working in the job. Like I said, what's going on at the moment? How's job security? How many times have I been saying on this channel, or it depends if you're new, about I give my program out for you to work for yourself. I don't care about what job you think you're happy about. If anyone tells you what to do, it is against you. Now, how can you see that that is crumbling this is like i said the planets are making changes the aquarius age we all knew 2020 was coming and the changes were coming this is about you thinking oh i have to work and do everything no i'll work get into a job because missions here as well and then he'll see me all glamorous right in this job whatever you're doing doesn't matter right and then they'll work with me and that is twin flame mission right didn't work like that didn't work in the old because this woman's all glamorous right 
holding her pentacle, where's my person? Looking into the dust, nothing's happening. Those look like kind of devil horns to me because you try to control it. But your person was just constantly showing up shielded and, as you would say, silly. This is my silly card. But this is your person. He's teaching you a lesson. This is not like in a horrible way of teaching you a lesson. This is about teaching you about um, going within. This is about um, working on your shadow, going on the inner child and being in your truth. Because the deception is you lying to yourself. It's about you thinking that you are of that outside world. Like I said, this is about inside, inside world, inside work, moon, dark shadow work. I always state get deeper. So this is what this reading is about. So if you've got my program, a uh, master program, this is the time to work on that hardcore because I'm going to be releasing a, uh, abundance. They go hand in hand. You won't get your abundance until you release the shadow for the abundance to come in, you see. So please work on that program. If you haven't got it, then please um, go buy that. Um, it goes with the Twin Flame program. Check out my website. If you're new, please check out my playlist. There's tons of information because um, some of you are at home now. Check out my playlist. Um, then um, it will keep you busy. Study it. It will push this forward. So hopefully this has been good for you. And thanks for listening.